It could go one of two ways, good or very bad. You guys, check out this amazing, massive garden haul that I did. We have, of course, our okra has overgrown, but we have a ton of peppers and tomatoes and banana peppers. And look at this freaking zucchini. That thing is huge. And this is a cucumber, you guys. So I picked all this. We're gonna pickle some of the cucumbers. And um, we're also gonna pick some of the banana, or pickle some of the banana peppers also. And check this out. We went and bought a pizza. And we are going to cook the pizza on the grill. So we're getting a little crazy, getting a little wild, and we are going to experiment. You guys know that we love to experiment. So that's what we're gonna do today. Let's get started. I think Jared's out there cutting some wood to get the fire started. Check in on him and see what he's doing, how far along he is. We'll get the fire started, put it on there, and uh, see how this goes. It could go one of two ways, good, or very bad. This is why we can't leave Jared alone unsupervised. He'll try and burn the house down. What did I tell you? Look at that. He got the ground on fire, people. Adding toppings to the pizza, to half of it, because Jason doesn't like anything. So those are the banana peppers that I pickled and we got some onions on there. And we're gonna cook that pizza out here on the grill. Looks like the fire's going. So this should be pretty interesting. What are you putting on there now? Italian garlic and red flake. Ooh, sounds yummy. So today I am making fire roasted pizza. Let's go check it out. So something happened to the footage. It wasn't usable. So I guess that just means we have to uh, cook another pizza. All right, what's up guys? Um, now we need to prepare to take the goats down there. So this is the pen we brought them back in. It was just a makeshift thing that um, the lady that uh, Biddy Boo's homestead that we got the goats from, she gave us. Uh, just to throw in there. It doesn't really fit. We need to come up with something a little more permanent, a little more uh, stable. So that's what we're going to do today. I'm not going to really do a tutorial. It's not going to be a how-to. It's just, this is what I'm doing. So let's check it out. Hopefully, fingers crossed, it goes well. All right, so we had a change of plans. The pin I had, I just cut all these extra metal pe uh, pieces off. I didn't use this extra wood that we have. I was going to do that, but not a, nah, no point. So what I did was I just kind of cleaned it up. I hooked it on all the edges the way it needed to be. Um, and now I'm gonna use this little cheap welder we got from Harbor Freight. I am not a welder. I will never probably ever say I know how to weld, but I taught myself on YouTube how to weld so I can halfway do it enough to make it stay. That's all I care about. So let's get to welding. I can't find my welding gloves, so I know safety first, right? At least I have a, at least I'm protecting my eyes. All right, I just got done trying to weld this stuff up. Let's check out these horrible welds. All right. Yep, pretty bad. So guys, we got some packages. Look at all these packages. We got box, box, package, 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 package. Huge mail haul. So let's open it. So it says seeds and it says it's from seednow.com. What do you guys think it is? Hops. Oh, these are cool. They're not like your typical <coughs> seeds. Monthly seed and garden club. Choose from one, three, six, or 12 month membership options. And then 20% off 
coupons, and carrots, blueberry bushes, peppers, yellow watermelon, some more hot chili peppers, some more chili peppers, some okra, lettuce, and melons. Dang, we didn't expect that. That's a lot of stuff. Happy planting, Jason. Does it say who this is from? So we don't know who it's from, but if you sent it to us, please, please, please let us know either in the comments below or send us a message because we would like to thank you. I don't want to like rip too much because I don't know if there's a letter in there or what. It's a gift for C. Saw this on a barbecue show and thought y'all might like it. Stews, barbecue, or whatever. Hope y'all like it. Wayne's World. Oh, Wayne. I told him whatever it is, it better not be too hot and trying to hurt us. Looks like some spices. It looks like Packaged it. very well, I'll tell you that. Untie yourself. This is why we're scared to leave Jared home alone. Right. Got some seasoning salute, Trader Joe's. I've heard Trader Joe's seasoning is awesome. Trader Joe's seasoning salute, 21 seasoning. That's probably all the same. And the same thing. Thank you so much, Wayne. This is gonna be used on everything. So here's a box from D. Hannah. So we got a letter. Hi, Crockers. Love y'all. Hope y'all hit 30K by this weekend. We hit 30K. P.S. Jaylena, a girl always needs a bit of bling. Oh, so I think this might be Jaylena's. Uh-oh. Any guesses, any it guesses? It felt like a shirt. Someone asked me if I liked glitter the other day. Uh-oh. That's all we need is a, a glitter a cat glitter. shirt. Maybe it's a glitter bomb. What in the world is that? Jason. Oh, never mind. Jared. Uh-oh. And me. Well, we each get one. Do you want to open see. yours first? What can it be? What in the world is this? A keychain? Oh, that? holy cow. Is that a belt buckle? No. Oh, wow. It's too bad we just switched our names. Oh man, are you kidding me? That's still really cool. That's to have, insane. The see. Crocker Homestead. Oh man, dude, that is awesome. I'm not. Oh, it's is it like a money thing. I think it's like a clip or something. How awesome is that? And you put your keys on that. I think that's what that is. I don't care. If it's that like is that. legit. Look at that. I don't care. If it's it's got our name shot. on it oh, and wow. everything. This thing is legit. Holy cow. <laughs> Did we all get the same one? Yeah, that is awesome. Man, that thing is legit. That right there is awesome. Did um? Is this like handmade? Yeah, I think they are handmade. This is something that is one of a kind. Well, wow, three yeah. of a kind. They well, look they're like they're each one of a kind. Dude, that is awesome. It's got the goat, the chicken, and everything. But you misspelled Crocker. Just get in. Uh -huh. Look at that, guys. Dude, that is. Awesome. That's crazy. This is the OG oh, thing. Cool. Wait, did it, it has just... your names on the back seat. Yeah, I know. Dude, that is awesome. I wonder if they handmade these. I think they're handmade. That's crazy. Debbie. This may be one of the coolest gifts we've received. Yeah. Now, I'm not downplaying anyone else's gift, but this is freaking awesome. So, Debbie, thank you so much. This is crazy. Thank you, Debbie, for giving me a beard, too. She saw it. It's grown out. She got Jason's nose ring, my nose ring. They are literally... One of a kind, they're slightly different. That's crazy. A piece of paper. Hi, Crockers. Enjoy your gift from Philip Lewis. Ooh. Uh -oh. oh, measuring cup. Someone needed those. Guess who's gonna be using these all the time? Probably me. Now I don't have to guesstimate with my half a cup measuring cup, because that's the only one I have. Thank you so much. I have got spoons too. That's awesome. That is something y'all should eat. Yeah. Now let's see if she'll actually cook. I just had to make frozen chicken, so yeah, we'll see. Guys, this is better than Christmas. How many presents did we get last Christmas? One. Jared got us <laughs> a blanket. Bottom Jared, up. what'd you get <laughs> last year? I got two uh, five dollar mystery boxes from the thrift store and two roommates. It was a, a manger and a something else. All right, that's what's up. This is a food hall right here. What? Oh, wow. That's ah! not paper. Ha! Yes, we Jared. needed some. I get one now. Yeah, Jared gets one, we get one. Big Newton. Big Newtons. There you go. And oh, a natural bamboo oh, wow. cooking and serving utensils. Because people awesome. don't want us to leach plastics. 
Now we don't have to leach plastic anymore. Man, you guys are awesome. Oh Hi, Crocker Kids. Every kitchen must have measuring cups and wooden cooking utensils. Enjoy your gift from Paula Wells. Thanks, Paula. You're awesome. Thank you, Paula. No excuse now. <laughs> All right, this is from Amazon. Thanks, Amazon. <laughs> Uh-oh. I think this one's for Jaylena. Why do you keep opening mine? <laughs> Oh, is that a game basket? It's a golf ball basket. Yeah, 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 we can go to the golf range. It's a free range large egg basket. That's cool. This thing is heavy duty. Is heavy yeah. Duty. You could put potatoes in here. You could put we eggs. We could use that for the garden too. Yeah, we could use, it depends on how big your load is. <laughs> There's no name on this, so who sent us this large basket? I don't know if it was the same, maybe combined one of these, or separate, but whoever sent this, please let us know. This is actually coated too, so this shouldn't rust or nothing. Yeah. So this is gonna come in handy big time. Thank you so much. Last right. one. Last one. And y'all say we're dangerous. I cut away from me. Towards me. Oh. A box. No way. Oh. Let me see if there's a note. No, it's from somebody else. That's so funny. That, is that the exact same set? Great minds think alike. That is, awesome. that is not the same set, is it? You it guys is. need more measuring Look. cups and wooden spoons. You'll be cooking all sorts of cheeses and foods soon enough, so you'll need these. I love your integrity. <laughs> Trust me, I improvise all the time, but you deserve the essentials. Amy. Oh my Thank god. Thank you so much, Amy. You this works it. out perfect because now Jared can have a set and we can have a set too while we're out on the ranch. Guys, so thank you so much. We got an egg basket. We got measuring, uh, cups. measuring cups. Measuring cups. Measuring cups. Spatulas. Spatulas. And spatulas. And fig and seasoning. Fig Newtons. And we are awesome. ready to cook. Custom clips. Clips. Dude, this has been better than Christmas. It's like our birthdays came early. So the fact that we got two sets of the exact same spatulas, three sets of the measuring cups and stuff, that's funny. That, I mean, you couldn't plan that. Yeah. Especially to come at the I same mean, time. That sounds like fate to me. Yes, that means we got a lot of cooking to do. And guys, it just happens that we're gonna be on our own for three months. Jared's gonna be on his own for three months. We got different sets, it works out. It was meant to be. No more leaching plastics, folks. Leaching plastics is oh, a thing goodness. of the past. It's chopsticks. For when I eat rice. Or it's if you have a giant splinter. Guys, thank you so much for watching today and sending us packages. It's just, it blows our mind that people want to send us anything, and we're super grateful. As you saw, we got the goat pen ready to go down there. I think Jaylene and I are going to leave either Thursday night or Friday morning. To go down there, we'll be down for a week, and then we'll come back. Jaylena's birthday is July 5th, so we're trying to get back in time to go to her sister's house to celebrate her birthday, her nephew's birthday, and just hang out with family before we leave for the 100 days. So we're really, really excited about starting this new adventure, going to the ranch. We've been trying to answer as many questions as we can. Just know that once we do go to the ranch, it's going to be very hard for us to comment back to everybody. We're going to try our best. Internet's going to be very limited, but we're going to do what we can. We're going to go to my parents' house from Rivera. We're going to go, you know, my grandma lives in Rivera. We're just going to do anything and everything we can to comment back to you guys. If you are on the Crocker family group, um, that's a great place for all you guys to communicate and all that type of stuff. I think tomorrow, what's today, Wednesday. So since we're leaving on Thursday night or Friday morning, I think we're gonna go live on Thursday. So just be prepared for that. It'll probably be Thursday around, you know, 6.30, 7, something like that. So just be prepared for that. Guys, thank you so much for watching. We are really, really excited about this whole adventure. We're excited about Jared's channel blowing up. He has over 1,500 subscribers. So thank you guys so much for going over and checking his out. Um, if you don't know already, Jared will be holding down the fort here. He's going to have his own YouTube channel. So go down in the description, check it out. We're going to post a video about our ranch. Um, not the video I did yesterday, but a video we did a while back of us camping out there and hunting. It's going to be down in the description if you haven't seen it. It'll give you more insight of what's going on down there at the ranch. Tomorrow, we're going to go live. 
get ready. It's going to be fun. Let's send us off with a bang. So, guys, we'll see you guys tomorrow. We got a lot of stuff to do before we leave.